Good afternoon. A major mess at a southwest Albuquerque intersection after an Albuquerque man ran from police back in May. Newly released video shows you what happened when officers tried to track him down after he slammed into another car. News 13's Dean Staley shows us the video. Dude, I have no information of what happened at all. A police service aide arrives to the frontage road near I-40 and 6th Street in the middle of May to help people involved in a multi-car crash. Did they figure out what happened? Uh, he was running from the police. APD officers were chasing 22-year-old Sean Ray, who they say hit a black car, causing two other cars to collide right beside the first crash. The reason we came over here because we got hit with so many vehicles we wanted to get out of the way. No, yeah, it's good that you guys got out of the way because they, uh, they had weapons and stuff. That's why I was, no one was here just yet to sure. get you guys a statement because sure. the scene wasn't safe yet, So they're, and they're still trying to track them down right now. Shortly before, officers had spotted Ray in a nearby parking lot trying to hide a gun. They say he took off in a white BMW. The officers tried to pull him over, but he sped away. Police say Ray ran a red light, seriously injuring a passenger in the black car. Hey, dude, I might need your help on this, dude. This is a mess of a scene. In the video, you can see the driver get out of the car, grab what police believe is a rifle and run off before returning to the car to get his shoe, which he'll need as he takes off on foot with two APD officers hot on his heels. The officers searched the neighborhood but are not able to track down Ray. He was on the run until he was arrested in late July. Dean Staley, KRQE News 13. The state asked Judge Maria Dominguez to keep Ray locked up through trial based on the violent nature of the crime. The judge released Ray on his own recognizance. He has pleaded not guilty to aggravated fleeing and reckless driving.